believe in ancestors. So I found myself joining them. So I found my life difficult. I end up seeing myself and mm, joining the bad things having a face different boys and uh, at home they said you see your things are not going well why can't you go to see sangoma to consult then i went to sangoma the first one it was an old man he said to me baby girl you're supposed to be a sangoma because you are a prophet and he said sometimes you will end up dreaming like having sex with someone but when you wake up there's no one right now by this time you're supposed to be at ndomba because i'm seeing you as a sangoma helping people and having your own throwing the bones nothing will go well with you if you don't submit to the ancestors so he gave me the instruction that i supposed to speak to ancestors like i should pray first to god when i pray to god i don't light but when i pray to their ancestors i have to light the candle then so i have to go yeah he said i have to do something like this then i will speak because really can you pray to god and at the same time consult the witch doctors and do things of witchcraft. Huh. And uh, nothing is moving still. The first day I did that, um, I dreamt of my mother and my mother, she's dead. That's how I said, wow, this is working. Ne? Oh, then, because you heard the voice of yes, your mother, you said, no, yes, it's working. Yes. Then when times goes on, I got the serious pain in my stomach. That pain is a womb. And uh, when I went back there, I told her about my problem. He said, yo, I'm seeing this womb will kill you. So you have to buy medicine. That medicine, you'll boil them. So I used to do that, but nothing happened. I was always sick. I remember I spent my two weeks in bed, not going to church, not doing anything. So I told my family that, okay, it's fine. I surrender myself. I'm going to be Sangoma. There's no way because nothing is moving in my life. Hallelujah. Amen. We have to talk about the Holy Spirit. We have to talk about him. Do you know that most of the time he is ignored? We have to focus on him. It is very important that we do that. The reason why people are going up and down. The reason why people are filled with wrong things. It is because they are lacking the real thing. God made man and calling you that for you to live and succeed you need something more than you own. you also know that on your own you are not adequate on your own you fail to make it on your own there are things that you cannot do You need some help. That is why people are going consulting. Hey, they go to the first prophets, prophesy to my life. They go to the Inyangas. Hey, throw down the bones. They go to the Sangomas. Tell me about my life. What shall I do? They are missing the real thing. Devil being the devil, the imitator, he will also come with imitations. He comes with phone call. That is why you see people happy. Me now, I've got the Amazos, I've got the, the spirits of our pants, and they are happy because. They are shown things, but because it's not the real thing, those things, when you go to sleep, they show you ugly things. They are going to show you accidents, and the accidents happen. They are going to show you death, and the death happen. And they are going to show you coffins, and family members die. What I'm trying to say is that you know very well that you need something or you need somebody. You know your weaknesses. You know your shortfalls. Uh -huh. Do you see that G? 
Jesus knew about it. He knew that me and you were going to need a helper. And he said, I will ask the Father, and the Father shall send you another helper. He is all you need. The helper. Where you fail, he is there. When you are weak, he is there. The strengthener. He is able to do all things. He empowered the Lord Jesus. And he raised the Lord Jesus from the dead. So when I am with him, when he is in me, I can say confidently, I can do all. There are many people with many questions. What is the real thing? How am I going to know that this is a real church? This is a true church of the day. The helper shall lead you into all truth. Many people say the work of Christianity is very difficult. It is difficult when you do it on your own. It is as difficult as trying to drive a car without petrol. A car without fuel. Same way, a Christian without fire. You have to be so dangerous to the devil. And you cannot do that on your own. You need the helper. You don't need any ropes around your waist. You need the you don't need the bewitched waters under your bed. You need the helper. There are those of you. You were told that you have got the spirits of Yamadi. And as a result, you are suffering. If you know that I'm talking about you, come in front. Pastor, now I was fellowshipping at ZCC. So they told me that I'm a prophet at that time. So I didn't take that seriously. When time goes on, I started dreaming being a pregnant as a man, being a pregnant. So I started developing, after the pregnant I told you, I started developing feelings for men. And th those feelings that when they come to me, I'll, I'll masturbate, I'll do things, I'll even download, buy a time to download pawns. So that pornography. pornography. So th and at, at that pornography, I'll, I'm not picturing me as I will be feeling those men, not women. Arnold Ray. Eh, And then why you And what did you do there? What did you do? What did you do exactly? It is all low. Eh. And? Then what? I But you see people's problems. So you started prophesying. broke that spirit. And sometimes, hundred kilometer, he feel a galik shakur. So he sent you to let, correct feel a car that he has gone back to his truck. And he sent you to let that spirit, heck, fetch all of that spirit. Car that we are going to let go of it. We are going to call it and ask somebody to go fetch it. And that thing in young Heta, oh man, he is busy with a pair. Like in the land of Why? All those things that are occupying there cannot remain anymore because he cannot share a house with another. And I say you all those imitations, all those imitations of the devil, all those counterfeits, they have to go now. Right now, right now, right now.